Um, hello? Is there anyone here? May I come in? I... I am looking for a blacksmith. Uh, Mr. Stillheart? I believe I... I need help with my sword. It broke in battle and... Whoa, miss, you, you are really beautiful. Oh, uh, I'm sorry. It's just that I, I was expecting, um, well. <laughs> I've heard of a great master blacksmith here, so I didn't expect you to be a woman. Not that I Doubt your skills, of course. Ah, so you are his daughter. I see, that makes sense. Well, uh, pleased to meet you. You see, I'm an apprentice paladin. I've heard of your father's talents and was hoping for some help in forging a new sword. <laughs> As you can see, this one is in pretty bad shape. You could say it's completely destroyed. Oh, you look appalled. Um, but don't worry, I have a good reason for coming back with such a damaged weapon. Uh, well, it served me faithfully so far, but let's just say it wasn't strong enough for the last battle <laughs> against the creatures of darkness. <laughs> you know... I face a shadow dragon in the in the forbidden in the forbidden valley a truly terrifying creature the sword held out in the end but at the last moment it shattered under the pressure of its sharp claws it was a truly epic battle um you don't seem to believe me. <laughs> I guess I'm not that convincing. Uh, um, you, you want to know the real reason why my weapon was destroyed? Uh, uh, well, uh, you see, uh, the truth is, I've been up against a bunch of goblins. At first, they seemed a modest opponent, but they were numerous and well organized. Although, I must admit, I found them rather ridiculous at first. <laughs> really? They were half dressed and bickering amongst themselves about who should attack me first. But as the battle wore on, my sword eventually succumbed to the pressure of their consistent attacks. I shouldn't have underestimated the situation. And now I'm left without a functional weapon. That's why I'm here, because I need your expertise. I heard your forge is the most renowned in the kingdom. So, um, could you repair it? Uh, look, I, I understand it's complicated, but you see, for me, this sword is more than just a weapon. It's, it's the symbol of my training and my determination to serve and protect.
Without it, I fear I won't be ready for my future missions. Oh, it's not repairable, is it? In that case, uh, can I request a new sword? By when do I need my new sword? Uh, tonight, perhaps? Uh, are you alright? You seem quite upset all of a sudden. Hey, please drop that hammer. Don't, don't come any closer. I'm sure we can talk this over. No need to resort to violence. <laughs> <sighs> Thank you very much. I'm sorry to make this request so suddenly, but I'm sure you'll be able to help me. You are among the best in the business. I know I can count on your expertise. Thank you again for your help. If possible, I'd like a new weapon with the same or similar composition as the old one. Here. Uh, here. You can see the metal in the debris I brought back. Mm, so, can you recreate something similar with what you have? Oh, you are missing a material. Silver. Well, silver isn't so rare, we shouldn't have trouble finding it. A specific kind of silver? Star silver, you say? Is it really such a rare material? You know, now I'm curious. What makes this star silver so special? Does it really come from the stars? Or is it called that because it shines so brightly? Well, looks like she's not listening to me at all. She seems preoccupied. Ah, uh, Mrs. Blacksmith? Everything alright? Is this star silver really that hard to find? Hmm, I see. It's quite deep in the mine. Well, perhaps I can help you. I would be happy to give you a helping hand. So, what do you say? Pretty please. I'm sure we'll be much faster together. <laughs> Thank you very much. I promise you, you won't regret it. Well, hurry up. What are you waiting for? Come on. Let's go. We've got work to do. Together, we'll find what we need to force the best saw possible. Thank you for giving me this chance, Mrs. Blacksmith. So, where's this mine? I hope you know the way. Ah, that's right. <laughs> it's your job after all. Exciting, isn't it? An adventure to find a rare metal. I never imagined doing this today. So, about this star silver. What makes this so special? Does it have magical properties? Or is it simply the rarity that makes it so valuable? Either way, I can't wait to see it.
<laughs> you must come here a lot, don't you? And you must know every nook and cranny of this mine. <laughs> I'm really impressed by your work. Forging weapons of this quality, it's incredible. Oh, we're almost there, aren't we? I feel the adventure getting closer with every step. Oh, uh, sorry. Am I talking too much? I, I'm sorry. It's just that I'm a bit nervous. It's a new experience for me, and I want to do well. Besides, I don't often get to walk around with a woman like you. I don't really know how to behave. <laughs> Maybe this adventure might bring us closer. I mean, that will work well together. And who knows? Maybe after this adventure, we can meet again under different, more relaxing circumstances. Hey, wait for me! Why are you walking so fast all of a sudden? I, I apologise if I said something inappropriate. It's just that, well, I find this adventure really exciting and you two are, oh, well, anyway, let's focus on the mission. Hmm. So I guess this is the mine entrance. What? Me? Scared? <laughs> Nonsense. I'm an apprentice paladin. I'm a brave fighter. Yeah. But still, um, I'd feel more reassured if you went first. Whoa, this place is gigantic. I expected it to be gloomy and scary, but it's not so bad after all. Whoa, look at all these different stones. It's beautiful. I wonder what kind of gems we can find here. Maybe sparkling diamonds or deep blue sapphires. Imagine the treasure hidden beneath our feet. It looks like a crystal fragment hidden in the rocks. I'm sure it must be a rare gemstone. You see, I have an eye for these things. <laughs> oh, so it's just quartz, huh? Hmm. I'll leave it to you to identify the stones from now on. <laughs> Oh, have you spotted the star still for all? Perfect, we can extract it now. Here, let me help you. Oh, it's harder to dislodge than I thought. It's hard, but we can do it a little more. We're almost there. Let's not give up. Are you ready? On the count of three. One, two, three. Look, it's working. We're almost there. Oh, careful, you're slipping. Yeah, I've got you. Are you okay, miss? Did you hurt yourself? Uh, here, let me help you up. Anyway, we managed to get this ore. Look at it. It's so beautiful. It's shining so brightly. Now, for the next step. Forging the sword. We can get out of here. 
Come, take my hand. Let's get back to the forge. Here we go. Ready to turn this all into a true paladin sword. I'm very grateful to you for taking on this task despite your busy schedule. Thank you so much. Mm, perhaps I should leave you alone to force the sword. I wouldn't want to disturb you. Oh, can I stay? Thank you. Thank you so much. I promise I won't make a sound. I'll be quiet as a mouse and... Oh, um, sure. I'll sit right here. Um, so you mentioned you couldn't repair my old sword, right? I see. That's what I thought. Making an identical sword, do you think you can do it? Thank you very much, miss. You are wonderful. Do you need me to help you? I'd be happy to help you. Preparing and monitoring the fire? Sounds doable. Especially if you're there supervising me. You can count on me. Whoa, look at that precision with which you handle these tools. It's impressive to see. Should I get more water to soak the blade? Yes, you do? Uh, I'll bring it right away. <laughs> it looks like it's going to be sharp enough to cut through anything. It's going to be a fearsome sword. It's so fascinating to watch the weapon come together under your hands. The rumours about you were true. You really have a talent for it. <laughs> We've made good progress. Looks like we are really meant to work together. Oh, it looks like it's already dark outside. Oh, I didn't even notice. I don't want you to tire yourself out over this. We should stop for the day. No, no, don't worry. I'll be okay without it for another day, I assure you. Also, trying to forge this in one evening was perhaps too ambitious. I'll be back tomorrow so we can get on with it. Uh, thank you again for your time. I'm eager to continue forging this sword with you. Good evening, miss. And... See you tomorrow. I am looking forward to seeing you again. <laughs>